Alright, Aaron, welcome back to the Children of Atlantis in insane roleplay. Um, <clears throat> in the Cthulhu mythos. And uh, yeah, we're surrounded by, not so really surrounded, but we have two neighbors that hate us already. As would be expected from the Cthulhu Empire's a bandit kingdom of, of Yig. And uh, the Ebion State, a holy tribunal of spiritual seekers. They're at least pacifists, but these guys might come attack at any time now. And um, we don't want to meet them, really. We're in the process of diving for, an, for a gas giant ship. And we'll see what we get there. Also, we have, we have some That's great plans. Things, but really. before, let's see about the special project. In a masterful display of engineering. The team under science officer Elena Dudnik has managed to gently raise the dilatated chick on Eurus 2 to the gas giant's upper atmosphere. Despite its age, the ancient cruiser is in remarkably good condition, and we have restored power to its systems. No trace of the original crew remains, but we have brought over our own and commissioned the ship into the fleet. Excellent! And it's, it's the same as the previous ship. It has very good weapons. Armor, shields, and everything is just very, very good with their thing. So let's integrate it into our fleet. Let's merge. <coughs> I love that to be in our fleet. Look at that. It costs us 10 minerals per tick if it's roaming out there. So hurry up, please. Hurry up. 10 minerals. Wow. <laughs> and then. Yeah, let's let's send that ship for Elena Dudnik also here. The impressive structures on the Klinda 4 surface, and then we'll explore this system and along these lines maybe then. So let's go forward and see what we can find there in the future. We're going to be in the process of expanding here on Procyon 2. So Getting access to more, more, more minerals. Because minerals is the most important thing to get in Apocalypse. And uh, this is not roleplay, this is just a, a harsh reality. Get minerals or die. At least on insane. Minerals, fleets, then the rest. Concluded. What have we found here? Ah, yes. Uh, we've built that Autochton monument now. Move a child of Atlantis here and hopefully have a lot more unity. Yes, doubling the unity. That's good. Let's continue our efforts here. With mm, probably some power. Um, some power building here. A power plan maybe. Let's see. How long will it be until we get this one in? A lot of days so we can start to remove something here and possibly build a new robot too so let's remove that bomb crater at least one should be okay you have to be careful though i mean we still have a stack of energy credits but this one should still be okay go. Alpha Centauri also going okay. It's all a little bit in the balance, right? Also this mining station would prob probably be very good to have. Giving full energy it's just an exceptional one. Ah, nice. We have that station now, and we can already move here. Pick the next cherry, shall we? Arrived, and we build. Already. Good, good, good. Not yet exceptional, but good. 
This is our science ship returning from its great journey here. Trying to explore Barnard Star, Sirius, and Henry system. Tile blocker clear. Nice, 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 nice. So next thing to look out for would be build another robot here. Research concluded. But we have now completed the research of genetic healthcare, enabling us to build gene clinics, increasing the growth speed. Colonization of alien worlds has opened up an entirely new field of bio biomedical research. And now we might go for, yeah, that. Selective defoliants or eco simulation. I think, let's see how much room we have. Mm. We don't have much energy credits for now, so I think that will be what we go first, and then we'll go for that later. It's also a little bit a cheaper way. Let's go for that first. Fred Fox is leveled up, though. Congratulations, Fred. Construction project complete. Nice, that has been completed. And Edic, monolithic. A clinic for uninhabited and indeed uninhabitable, but not unvisited. This toxic world, its surface is littered with tall cenotaphs carved from some mineral not native to the planet. Aliens. More aliens, evidently placed here by some artistically inclined spacefaring race. The monolith's flowing lines deftly chart a history so fantastical it must surely be fictional. They're beautiful. Image them for the archives. Shall we do that? Or oh, they are beautiful. Make digital reproductions of the monoliths widely available in our empire. Beautiful? Would we be people that are beautiful or would we image them for the archives? We're, we're fanatic materialists. We'll image them for the archives. Also, and you can already move to the next possible station. Which would be probably at the center. It would be a good station. Look at that. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Now you're in the orbit and... Yeah, the minerals... Should be growing again. And... Oh, you. Yeah, you're ready. Well then... Here, go to Bobagon. Ooh, have you seen that? They've just expanded. Can really move to the next asteroid here. Go, go, go. As we say. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. hmm, hmm, hmm. Sarnak is a good system. Nine in total, but that has even ten. Maybe we do, don't need the Sarnak system. Maybe not. Hmm. Yeah, we need to wait this out. It's it is as it is. Get that upgrade. We could build a new robot soon. All kinds of things, but we need more energy credits too. Ah, now we're presented with a choice again. I hate these choices. Yeah, we'll wait for that. We'll build something for more minerals very soon here in the Procyon system. That's the most reasonable cause of action and we'll, we shall be with that. Science ship here. Survey these systems. Construction project concluded. Good stuff. Now let's continue here. 
end. Next upgrade can be made here or rather the power plant, right? Yeah, we'll need to move. We need to use the power plant here. It will also be good for us, so it's all nice. All nice, hopefully. Need to look at this. Maybe move to Sarpad. Or Sarak. Sarak also has good good station. Ah, ha, 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 ha. That's the safe choice. That's the risky choice. And that's even better. Yeah, I think... I think we'll move this way. Safe and better. Viktor Turgenev has leveled up. Oh, Viktor Turgenev? No, he's not really called Viktor Turgenev, right? He's called... Da, 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 da. Yeah, at a very young age, he'll live to 105. We can do this. Yeah, Viktor Turgenev. They also call him... Coming from that name that's very close, the Baltic Dude. And he's also busy leading physics research, right? Ah, uh, now an astrophysicist. Mm -hmm. I think we'll wait a little bit until we have someone, someone good here to, to recruit. This was just too Baltic for me to pass up. That the game, good that the game reminds you of these things from time to time. Uh, I think we can risk that now. Should be okay. Also now, uh, Rita? Yeah, Rita is meticulous. Good, 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 good. That was important. They're expanding, we're expanding. An anomaly. An anomaly. Site of activity by an ancient precursor civilization on this inhospitable rock? Research, Rita. Research Rita. Where's that last rock? Construction project concluded. Well, that was the last rock, was it? Yes. Now we're at 90. 90, 90, 90. Hmm. I think we should start saving time here, maybe. No, we cannot afford this. Um, Sarak would also be so good. For the energy we get. You now what we let's move to Brink. Enter this orbit. Or rather Let's even move to Vir. We'll need the energy from this. But before, we need this ship to build the next outpost here for more minerals. Research concluded. And we've completed the research of automated exploration protocols. Wow, that's a little bit, little bit bad now, but still. An advanced AI will aid science officers in their task to explore strange new worlds, to seek out new life and new civilizations, to boldly go. 
where no Blorg has gone before, the science ship will be able to explore the galaxy with help from an AI. And now it will be timed for... for what? Power generation? Would probably be good. Assist research would also be good. Mm. No, I think power generation it is. We should use that now. that outpost too so we can be ready for that importante muy importante we have the Vultaum trade post Barnard Star 1 was home to a small Vultaum outpost where they traded with several neighboring civilizations at some point, the trade post appears to have been converted into a religious mission where the Vultaum attempted to convert visiting alien merchants to their philosophy. Trade ceased shortly afterward and the planet was eventually abandoned. Situation Fascinating. Cannot yet research that. Well, okay. We'll wait for Elena. For this anomaly. Go for more energy. Are not starving very good. We'll see what we can do. I think we can now even reinforce the fleet. I think it's time. It seems a good idea now, so let's do it. System survey concluded. Good, good. All the way, all the way. Construction project concluded. Ah, good stuff. Our ship, we're at 1k strength, that's good. You're going to the Vir system. Build that mining station here. While you're at it. We managed to move one ship in. That's quite nice. And we're at 90 again. I like that. For some reason. System survey concluded. Oh, and there are signs of activity by an ancient precursor civilization on the inhospitable rock of Borbagon too. Let's research. Construction project concluded. Nice. So that was successful so far. Construction project Sopard. So Sopard one, the molten world. Yeah, that's a good system too. We have a Vultaum satellite. A small Vultaum satellite was found in orbit of Borbagon 2. It had been set up to continuously repeat a message until its power source drained millions of years ago. We salvaged its transmitter array, but could only recover a small portion of the transmission. The main purpose of this satellite was apparently to preach the dominant Vultaum philosophy to neighboring civilizations. Its message speaks of the need to disconnect and to embrace true existence, whatever that means. Situation log updated. Hmm, to disconnect? Will we disconnect? 
Let's have a look. Can we disconnect? Can we... Need skill 5. We need skill 5 to disconnect. Well, Elena will... I don't know. Go somewhere else to disconnect. Have we explored this? This is on the verge of being discovered, everything. So we'll go back and maybe move here. Along these lines to, to survey a bit. And we need to build something new here. Possibly a hydrophonics farm. So let's leave this here and then move it over there in the future. So pad. Hmm. So it's a matter of safety to expand into the Bobagon system. Like securing that system would save us pirates from here. And that would be really good. So let's see. I'll get something going on here. <laughs> Yeah, and we'll also build a power plant. But after that... Hoo hoo hoo! Projects, projects, projects. Extremely interesting, but also... Construction project concluded. Don't exactly know what to do, right? Um... Well, for once, this will be... Could build that, but we don't need it. We need more minerals though, so let's build that one. Still preferring the minerals. Let's build that project. Yeah, let's now continue our way to Skorum. Research concluded. Mineral processing. Optimal processing of mine minerals have allowed us to reach new levels of efficiency. We've got the mineral processing plants. They produce some minerals of, on their own, but more importantly, increase the overall mineral output of the planet. And now, what would be good? <laughs> Robo modding. Oh my god. Yeah, that would be good, but the question is, can we afford that? Should probably rather go for even either that or that. Coil guns or caramel metal materials. That would limit our losses, which is more important probably at the moment. Let's go caramel metal materials right now. The survey completed. Through our surveys of habitable worlds, our biologists have collected a vast amount of data on alien life forms. Many of our older theories on the development of life have been disproved, and our scientific community has had to build new models from scratch. Our most interesting findings are being displayed at the newly dedicated Museum of Exobiology on New Atlantis. The public is enthralled, and many donations have come in to aid in the continued search of strange life forms. Oh, 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 oh. energy credits. Which means we don't need this one. I think we might just fly over to Barnard Star. This construction ship. Enter this orbit. Yeah, build something there, build something on Sirius and expand there. That's the plan. System survey concluded. Good stuff. Enough unity for the science division. The number of science and medical officers has been increased throughout the fleet 
organized into a special science division. To support this corps of officers, new training programs have greatly accelerated the rate at which we commission new science officers. We we'll get more science alternatives. Sirius is fully surveyed too, which is a great system. Alpha Centauri Prime. Pop construction is ready. There we go. There's a lot to do here. <laughs> a lot. I believe, I don't know what I believe exactly, but I believe we can build one more Corbett soon. So let's go to the fleet manager and like add some Corbett's. One Corbett might exactly be good. <coughs> Haneri, oh, a savanna in an arid world. Love that. Construction project concluded. Well, Centauri Prime finished the surface construction. Good, good. We have that going for us, and so, 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 so. Construction project concluded. Starbase, yes, nice. Construction project concluded. And Subhad gets another mining station here. Go, go, go. As they might say. Hmm. Pirates sighted in the Oh no, in the Bobagon system. They're using this lawless system as a base from which to raid our space. Not good. They must be dealt with. Fly away, though, to Eurus. And charge! Yeah, it's definitely the way to that we need to build something in Bobagon. For now, we'll have to fight. <laughs> it was the right plan. Just too late. Too late to be sorry. Now we cannot do this, and now we can probably already build this in Barnard Star instead, so we don't forget. Never forget. Thank you for watching. We'll have a fight against pirates soon. Let's hope we don't lose too many of our great stations here. Have a good time until next time, and happy gaming. What will we find out about this strange... Cthulian spiral universe in the future be there when we hopefully survive. May Cthulhu guide your dreams. <laughs>